bit. <laughs> how's that? How's that been for you? It's been good, you know. Haven't really played offense in a while, so I'm just getting them down. You catch a little flat from the guys on the defensive side of the ball when you go over there. Oh yeah, of course. You know, we're all we we call ourselves the dark side. You know, and sometimes I go over there. You know, they get a little mad. But it's all love. Do you feel that you'll be used in offense at all this year? I mean, I don't know. You know, I'm just controlling what I can control. They tell me to go. You know, go to offense. I'll go to offense and you know, help them out or do whatever I have to do for them. So, is, that is that something you want to do a little bit more this year? Or is I mean, of course, I feel like any you know athletic or you know type of person would love to play offense. You hear Kevin, even you know Darren Gardner, like let me play offense. But you know, we just we always. It's like offensive guys think they're defensive guys, and defensive guys think they're offensive guys. So it's cool. So you're recruiting any of those guys to come over and play defense then? Uh, no, nah, not really. We just, we, we're good with our, our guys. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Does it bring back you know the old Bellevue days when you were able to, to run up and down the field on offense? A lot yeah, of course. You know Bellevue days was real fun. We had a lot of you know a lot of guys. So it wasn't really a lot of plays on me for offense because we had all these guys going close on. So it was cool. Got a little heated out there. I mean, I feel like. Where you guys are want to be on defense right now? I mean, I mean, it's, this time of your defense is a little yeah. bad, but what you guys were able to do? I mean, it's ball. it's all love, you know. Some guys need to keep their poise. Sometimes, you know, we have a little argument out there. And, you know, one guy made a, a bad, you know, hit or something, and then the defense guy retaliated. And you know, the, the refs are always going to get that second guy. You know, there's a fourth down. We made a stop. The guy took off his helmet. That could be another flag, another first down. So just keeping your poise throughout this whole practice is what the defense really needs to work on. What are you trying to do to build up what you guys were able to accomplish last year? You guys really snuck up on a lot of people. I mean, we're trying to get wins, you know. <laughs> we were 7-6 and six last year with the best defense. That doesn't, you know, people, all people can say is you got the best defense, but you lost six games. So and then again, we're just trying to win. But right now, we're just thinking about the next day. So tomorrow we'll have film, lift in, get that settled in, and then Friday back to practice. Last year, you guys, everybody talked about how young you were in the secondary, but it just looks like the chemistry out there, and you guys look almost a little bit of swagger back there. Talk, <laughs> yeah, of course. Talk about the chemistry back there. I mean, it's it's good chemistry because, you know, right when Coach Lake got here, you know, my class was here, and then, you know, Kevin and Brandon's class bought in, so we're all come together. We're all like brothers. We all do stuff on the uh, like off season or after practice. We we'll all go hang out, go to Wingstop or something like that. So you know we have a really good chemistry. But it also just seems like you know where every other person's going to be too. Just your, the mental side looks yeah, like exactly. it's all there. You know, watching film and Coach Lake, you know, does a great job when we have our meetings. So what each person's supposed to do and you know as a cornerback they're trying to also learn what the safety does and as a safety we got to know nickel cornerback so we're all on the same page when they run you off the corner blitz on the quarterback how much do you enjoy that oh that's that's fun especially when you know it's jake out there i love to you know try and get jake because jake's real competitive so um mac talks about like it's obviously he got filled in yeah. pretty well last year I mean, I mean, he's doing great. You know, last year he did great. You know, still wasn't really good with the calls, but he's a real banger. Will hit anyone, no matter how big you are. If you saw last year, he tried to take on a Stanford O lineman. You know, he so he's not afraid of anything. He's getting smarter and faster and stronger each day. Same with you know everybody else. So it's gonna it's gonna be good. Yeah, you're pretty hard on the play last year, didn't you? Yeah, I think so. Kind of knocked me out. So yeah. <laughs> Give him a hard time about that at all? Oh, of course. You know, <laughs> we always do that. He he's known for that, so we we like, hey, if you're in, watch out, man. Hit the other team, not us. <laughs> what have you seen? It seemed like you and Chico have gone head to head a lot. What have you seen? One of the guys, Browning, kind of singled him out as one of the most improved guys out here. What have, what have you seen out of Chico? Oh, Chico, you know, he's real fast, quick guy. Uh, I feel like he'll soon learn how to control his speed because with Chico, it's either you're going, you're going top speed, whatever you're doing, you're running top speed, so he'll learn how to control his speed, his body, and he'll be, he'll be great. See a guy you go, obviously grew up around here too, did you know him? Oh Ice yeah, you know, bit? when we were little, we, we were on the same track team, oh, you're so, okay. you know, he was one of those not fast guys, but when we ran hills, he would beat everybody. You see his huge calves, he, he, he would beat even the older people when we run hills, so, but now he, he, he's coming to his speed, and now he needs to learn how to control.
Was that in Federal Way? Or was uh, it was in, no, nah, it was in uh, Seattle. It was called like Seattle Speed. Okay. So it was cool. You and him in a rematch out here, 100 yards, who wins? Oh, of course, me. I'm never going to say another person is going to beat me. I don't care. <laughs>